اعوذ باللہ من الشیطان الرجیم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم کلاس ٹویلتھ سبجیکٹ پولیٹیکل سائنس ٹاپک ڈائمنشنز آف گلوبلائزیشن اور وٹ آر دا کانسکوینسز آف گلوبلائزیشن ڈیئر اسٹوڈینٹس گلوبلائزیشن از اے ملٹی ڈائمنشنل کنسیپٹ گلوبلائزیشن از اے ملٹی ڈائمنشنل کنسیپٹ اٹ مینس اٹ از اے واسٹ کنسیپٹ اٹ ہیز پولیٹیکل اکانمک اینڈ سوشو کلچرل مینیفیسٹیشنز پولیٹیکل گلوبلائزیشن گلوبلائزیشن has affected the traditional concept of the state sovereignty. It has eroded the capacity of the state by reducing the ability of the government to do, to do what they want to do. The entry and enhanced role of MNCs, multinational companies all over the world has reduced the capacity of the government to take independent decisions. Number second, economic globalization. Globalization is closely linked with traditional, with, globalization is closely linked with international institutions. like IMF and World Bank, International Monetary Fund and World Bank. Both these institutions play a major role in determining economic policies all around the world. The global financial institutions are an instrument of US policy and if there is a QC imperial power, it is the United States. Cultural globalization. It refers to the growth of cause cultural contact. It has affected our domestic life, food, drink, dress and ideas. It has even affected people's preferences leading to the fear that it threatens world culture cultures globalization is a multi-dimensional concept it has political economic and cultural manifestations in you know, aspects political globalization globalization has affected the traditional concept of the state sovereignty it has eroded the capacity of the state by reducing the ability of the government to do what they want to do the entry and enhanced role of mncs all over the world has reduced the capacity of the government to take independent decisions Economic globalization. Globalization is closely linked with international institutions like IMF and World Bank. Both these institutions play a major role in determining economic policies all around the world. The global financial institutions are an instrument of US policy and if there is a QC imperial power, it is the United States. Cultural globalization. It refers to the growth of cross-cultural contact. It has affected our domestic life, food, drink, dress and ideas. It has even affected people's preferences leading to the fear that it threatens world cultures. Thanks. Have a nice day.